This presentation is focused on using the Web 2.0 to VoiceThread to enhance language learners' experiences in second and foreign language environments. Specifically, this presentation will provide an overview of how you can use VoiceThread to enhance the language learning skills for foreign and second language learners. Students are growing up in a digital age where technology is being integrated into all aspects of their lives. For example, students have access to digital technology in their classroom settings, in their community settings, and in their home environments. A large number of these students also use digital technology to communicate with their peers through social media sites such as Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. In fact, approximately 73% of American teenagers are now using these types of social media sites. As a result, the incorporation of technology into 21st century classrooms is becoming increasingly more prevalent. One reason is that educators are beginning to recognize the role that technology can play in enhancing student learning outcomes. This has resulted in the use of technology in classrooms previously being used for material distribution and teacher communication to now it being used for enriching collaborative educational processes. Through the use of technological assignments, educators can help enhance students' levels of critical thinking skills, their creativity, their levels of motivation, and autonomy. Therefore, educators have become more aware that technology may have an impact in student learning outcomes. One commonly used type of technology that's being integrated into classroom settings today is Web 2.0 tools. These are tools which are described as technology that supports active learning for students and help students acquire group learning processes. Through the use of this type of technology, students are able to be creative in the types of assignments they create, they are able to collaborate with their peers and teachers without being in the same setting, and they are able to edit and provide feedback on their own and others' work. They are also able to share content they create with their classmates, with their teacher, and other relevant audiences outside of their classroom setting. One commonly used type of Web 2.0 technology that is often being integrated in classroom settings today is VoiceThread. Educators who use this technology are able to provide their learners an online social networking tool that allows them to discuss in an asynchronous environment. VoiceThread is an online tool for collaborative work used for documents, photos, and videos. This tool also contains features that allow students to vocally respond to discussion questions. They can also provide a video, or they can type in text, or they may use a combination of these three. They can also illustrate their thoughts through a drawing doodle tool. Educators are able to create engaging lessons through the use of VoiceThread since they are able to upload slides or videos for learners to navigate through to learn new content. This program also accepts digital formats in a wide array of forms such as WAV, JPEG, and PowerPoint. Through this application, educators and learners are able to provide comments using text, audio, and or video pictures. Therefore, educators may be able to meet the needs of a diverse range of students in their classes during voice their activities since they are able to combine audio and visual components. Essentially, educators are able to create a conversation around the materials that they upload to the system to facilitate a learning context inside or outside their classroom setting. Educators are also afforded the option to secure all postings to be viewed by designated individuals only or they can create public threads that are available to anyone. Additionally, unlike other Web 2.0 tools, users are not required to use an email account to participate. Through the use of VoiceThread assignments, educators are able to reflect on students' levels of understanding of the content, and students are able to reflect on the content, their own responses, and the responses of their classmates. Also, students are afforded the opportunity to re-record their responses as many times as needed. This feature may help to lower students' levels of anxiety and need to provide a verbal response that will be accessible to their classmates and teacher. Students are also able to hear all of their classmates' thoughts, opinions, or beliefs of a topic and provide a follow-up response regarding the perceptions of the response or a follow-up response or question. Teachers are also able to provide to all students through this type of technology feedback. 
Although voice start is fa fairly straightforward system to navigate, educators can initially provide learners simple assignments to help them become comfortable with the applications of the system. For example, educators may want to include icebreaker activities through VoiceThread as a way for students to feel comfortable providing posts in the system. VoiceThread activities can help language learners to become more proficient in all four language skills, specifically speaking, listening, reading, and writing. Particularly since in order for learners to complete these types of assignments, they need to read, for example, PowerPoint slides, listen to their teacher and or their classmates, and provide a verbal and or written response to the assignment prompt. As a result, language learners are able to be provided repeated exposure to language in a non-threatening environment. Learners are able to pro be provided individual interactional opportunities, which may be difficult in whole class environments as well. Learners are able to hear their teacher and classmates discuss content in our vocabulary, as well as listen to authentic language materials such as television and news clips. The multitude of assignments that can be developed with this technology are endless, which can help to, to keep and maintain learners' interest. If learners are motivated to learn, their language skills may develop rapidly since they perceive their assignments as fun and not anxiety provoking. Also through voice or activities, students are provided more interactional opportunities. This is important since many students may not have access to the target language outside of their classroom environment. However, one problem that may often arise in language learning environments is that teachers talk more often than their students, which can hinder students' levels of target language speaking proficiency. As a result, through the use of voice threat activities, students are able to interact more often, which is essential to enhancing their levels of language proficiency. In order to enhance students' levels of speaking proficiency, teachers can require students to provide audio responses through the microphone or video feature. This will help teachers to determine if students are able to accurately produce the language and provide constructive feedback on the learner's spoken response. For example, a teacher could create a lesson focused on a set of new vocabulary terms and require learners to provide a video or audio recording of their ability pr to pronounce each term. Not only could the teacher require the student to repeat each term, but they could also require learners to create new sentences using each term, which can help to reinforce learning. Each learner could also individually provide a recording of the terms and have the opportunity to listen to and practice saying the terms prior to providing his or her recorded response. This can be vital in language learning environments since learners need repeated exposure to new content and need many interactional opportunities. Teachers could also provide students the opportunity to record their oral presentations through this technological tool. This could help students feel less anxious presenting information since they are not required to do so in front of their classmates. This could be one successful way to enhance students' levels of self-efficacy in acquiring the target language. Additionally, due to time constraints and the large number of students who may be enrolled in language classrooms, teachers may not be afforded the opportunity to check each individual student's level of understanding for each aspect of the lesson. However, through voice thread assignments, the teacher can require all students to provide a response demonstrating their level of understanding during class time and or for homework assignments. Teachers could incorporate activities such as having students describe a picture or video focused on the content they are learning. Another activity that teachers could implement is having students complete test review activities through voice thread. For example, the teacher could assign each student specific content to provide an overview on or have students share the most salient aspects of a chapter. The VoiceThread application could also be particularly useful for language learners since they are provided a forum in which they can listen to their teacher's prompts, directions, and lectures multiple times before providing a response. Additionally, teachers could record stories, lectures, or textbook excerpts so that students are able to listen to these materials multiple times. Also, students can listen to a reading passage while also following along the information in a written format. This method could help learners begin to make connections between the, what they see and hear. Learners can also interact with students across the globe through voice threat activities. This could be particularly beneficial for learners who are acquiring English as a foreign language. Educators can collaborate with schools in other countries or regions to provide learners exposure to native-like pronunciation and vocabulary terms and slang that may be regionally specific. 
For example, students could be exposed to British English, Australian English, and American English through these types of assignments. This could also enhance learners' listening skills since they are able to hear dialect differences. Through voice thread activities, educators are also able to incorporate materials focused on current events. For example, educators could upload news articles, magazines, and news clips outlining current events. Prior research conducted on video extracts and retelling these events have resulted in large language learners' improvement in fluency, accuracy, and marked repertoire. As a result, using real-world activities can also help to engage learners and increase the retention of the content. These types of activities can also provide a cultural component to the lesson by providing learners an understanding of current local and world events. Learners can also learn life skills such as understanding and providing directions. For example, educators can provide a picture of a map and ask students how to arrive to a particular destination. Students could then be required to provide a voice or response outlining the most direct or quickest route to the designated address. Another activity could require students to create a voice thread providing overview, pictures, artifacts, etc. of their native countries. This type of assignment could provide language learners the opportunity to share their native countries with their classmates, which could also help to add a cultural component to the lesson. In order to enhance learners' levels of reading skills in the target language, teachers can also upload examples of authentic materials to the voice thread link. The use of authentic materials in language classrooms can be a, an effective way to expose students to real language when they that they may encounter outside the classroom setting. However, since these types of materials are typically created for native speakers of the language community, language learners may have a difficult time understanding them. Therefore, through the use of voice thread activities, teachers are able to evaluate students' responses to determine if they understand authentic materials that they may have access to in their home and community settings. The teacher could also require students to provide a written response to the voice their assignment. Then the teacher can require students to read their classmates' posts and, and provide a follow-up response. Through this type of activity, the teacher can determine the student was able to accurately comprehend their classmates' postings. Moreover, the teacher could provide extensive feedback to students regarding their work and have the student read and respond to the comment or complete an additional activity focused on the comments. The teacher can use this type of activity to engage students' levels of reading comprehension. VoiceThread also provides the capability of a doodling feature. Through this tool, educators and learners are able to draw and highlight salient features outlined in their post. This tool could be utilized in an assignment in which learners were required to share their perceptions of an assigned reading. The teacher could upload a segment of a reading that was discussed during class session. For example, a historical period of time. Learners could provide a response outlining of their perception of their reading provided and how it relates to what they learned during class. The learners could highlight, circle, draw any information that helps to illustrate their response. In order to enhance students' levels of writing skills, teachers can require the students only provide written responses to voice their assignments. Additionally, teachers can require that students read all or a specific number of their classmates' responses and provide descriptive feedback. The feedback could be focused on how their responses were similar or diverse, or they could be required to provide a follow-up question to their classmate. Students could also be required to provide a post outlining a short story or poem that they wrote. Another task used to enhance writing skills could be for teachers to upload writing strategies such as graphic organizers and have students discuss the purpose of the materials and how they can enhance their writing skills. Additionally, teachers could upload examples of correct and incorrect grammatical forms or sentences and have students share their opinions as to why each form or sentence is or is not grammatically correct. Teachers could also create multicultural educational activities through VoiceThread. For example, teachers in different geographical locations could create and share VoiceThread links in which their students are able to share information about their schools, language, or culture. Through this type of activity, students could enhance their writing skills as well as develop an understanding of linguistic and our cultural differences. Since many language learners do not have the opportunity to communicate in the target language outside their school environment, voice thread activities can provide students additional practice opportunities to enhance their language skills. If students have access to the internet in their home or community settings, teachers can create voice thread assignments in order for students to practice these skills. 
These types of activities can help to create a community of language learners in the classroom as well. Since some language programs now offer online language learning classes for their students, this can create a disconnect between the teacher and their students and among the students in the class. Through the use of voice their activities, students are able to see and hear each other within an online class, which can help them to feel more connected. This can help to decrease the levels of anxiety students may experience in these learning environments, since they may be more likely to feel as part of the class. Additionally, students in these environments may feel more motivated to learn since they are able to receive extensive feedback from their teacher and classmates. Additionally, since students are afforded more language practice opportunities through voice or assignments, they may feel more confident in their abilities to produce the lo target language.